Oh, today's Victoria's birthday. Victoria can just go to a glue factory. Hey guys, and welcome back to Animal Crossing New Leaf. Uh, you'll notice that I have different hair because I went over to Quindolin's town and just needed a new do. Also, it's in honor of my silver bangs, which I recently dyed. Uh, well, they're not quite silver yet, but we're getting there. We're working progress. Anyway, welcome to New Katoria. We have a lot to talk about today. Uh, so I'm going to introduce you to my new villagers. So come here. This is Lucy, and she's a pig. And I really like her. Her catchphrase is snoink, and it's really cute. I've been reading a book recently on interior design. It's really got my creative juices flowing. I want my place to look just as stylish as the one in the book, but I need new furniture. Girl, you gotta go to Ikea. If you find furniture you think I'd like, I'd appreciate you picking it up for me. Oh, I give her stuff all the time. I give her furniture, like, all the time. Also, apparently I have a letter, so I guess I'll read that. From Henry. By the time you read this letter, I'll have already moved far, far away. This farewell leads me to a new challenge. I hope you'll support me from afar. Moving forward, Henry. Yeah, I wanted him to move out. He was a frog. Not really a fan of frogs in this game. So, I kind of just let him move out. But anyway, look! Elvis! He's one of my favorites. He's a lion. And he seems angry. He's in a bad mood. I think he's a cranky villager. But I really like him. I love the lion villagers. And I was so excited when I had him in my town. He's a new... He's a new guy. Oh, you. I don't trust you. Not after last time. Sahara. This is Kyle. He is a wolf that looks high a lot. It's been raining for a while now. Everything's getting muddier and muddier, Alpha. So something up, Alpha? Yeah, we'll chat. Hey, lucky you, Kita. I'm feeling well. snaz tastically generous today. You gonna give me something? Here, why don't I just give you my effects rack? Little gift for me to you. Well, it's just a little thing, but don't forget, a little goes a long way. Well, uh, a lot isn't much at all. Well, I think my big talk ran out of gas there. Anyway, enjoy the gift, Alpha. Thanks, man. Alright, he looks a little high, but he's still pretty cool. Also, uh, Mayor Quindolin gave us coconuts and, like, a whole bunch of other fruits, which was really nice. Now we have bananas. We have nanners. So, that's pretty cool. I'm trying to find all of the villagers because there's a lot. Um, no, I think that's Lucy's house. Whose house is this? This is Victoria's house. I don't like Victoria. I want her to move out. If she doesn't move out, well, we know how to handle that. But, my favorite villager is Anka, and she lives in here. And look at her! She is so amazing! She's like an Egyptian kitty! There's a rumor going around that I'm a tree hugger? Really? Like, not really. This is Victoria. I want her to move out. She looks stupid. Also, I'm not a big fan of horses, so get out of my house. Dude, I want, like, all your stuff, Anka. Like, her house is so cool. Get out of here, Victoria. But anyway, for the most part, I'm happy with my villagers. There's a couple that I don't like who moved in, you know, later. And I'm just, I'm trying to get rid of them, but, you know. You know. You know. So, there's a few of them. A lot of them, like, they all, like, clustered over here. So, I just kind of put my house... I rebuilt my house basically in the middle of them. In the middle of all of their houses, so. And we got some pears up here. Uh, this flag is in is in uh, memory of the fallen. Uh, doo -doo. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, here's someone. Oh, this is Nate. He's a very strange bear, but I kind of like him. He's kind of nice. I buried a time capsule for him. 
Oh, he wants fruit. Yeah, sure. I'll probably forget, but, you know. Hold on, let me see. Here, turn around. There. That's what he looks like. He's kind of cute. I mean, I'm not sure why he, like, dyes his eyebrows, but, you know, I'm not gonna judge. So... Oh, also... <laughs> so we meet again. What could I do for you, butt snort? <laughs> That's his catchphrase. <laughs> You're three ball tea? Okay. I guess I'll buy it from you. I don't really want it, but... I kind of like Nate, so... I guess I'll buy it from him. Um... Oh, we're in Bolton. Oh, today's Victoria's birthday. Victoria can just go to a glue factory. Okay, so... I think Nate lives here. And I have some people who live over here. Oh, here. Here's one. This is Mira. She is a cute little bunny. And her catchphrase is Cottontail, which I think is really cute. Oh, hey, there's a rumor going around about you, you heard? Everyone's saying Kita is quite the tree hugger. Kind of see what they're talking about, Cottontail. Rude. She's cool, though. Like, here, look. See, she gets a little superhero. She's cute. She moved over from Eco Batman Town, I guess. Or, I don't think she was actually living there at the time, but I think she used to live there, and then she decided to move to my town, so. No, I don't want to talk to Sahara. She sucks. She made my house look like butt. Oh. There's probably a fossil there. Or maybe a gyroid, because it's raining. Also, I have a perfect orange. I need to plant that. Eventually when I have the time. There's one, I think there's one more villager. Da, 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 da. Yeah, see, we got a lot of fruit <laughs> from uh, from Kundalin. She gave us like everything, so. Got some pears, some butts, some durians, some apples, uh, cherries. I think those are perfect cherries. Uh, I don't know, what, are, those, are those perfect apples? I'm not sure. And, okay, so that's, and then we have, uh, the gravesite for those who perished in the massacre. And then up here, I'm assuming he's home. Is he not home? Oh no, that's Mira's house. Henry used to live, like, around here, but he doesn't live here anymore. And that's okay. Ah, here's Rory. He's kind of a... He kind of is a weird-looking lion, but I kind of like him. He's a jock. This Saturday's a bug off. Recently, I've been using a net with a 30-pound weight in it as part of my training. Huh, there's no doubt I'm going to be the winner of this competition. Snooze it. I don't know what... I don't know what that catchphrase means, but okay. So, I have two lions, which I'm actually really happy about. Because I really like them. So, yeah, pretty happy with all my villagers, except Victoria needs to leave. Oh, wait, there's one other villager that I hate. Forgot about her. Victoria for sure needs to leave. And this one needs to leave. Hold on, I'll find her. I'll find her. Know where her house is. Ah, where are you? Paula Dean, where are you? <sighs> She's shopping, maybe? Oh, there's something down there. I guess I'll go get it. A lost item. People do stuff all the time in this town. It's kind of ridiculous. Dude, Lucy, where is freaking Paula Dean? Ah. I don't like her, and then she makes it difficult to find her. Is she on the beach? No, I don't think she's on the beach. Well, dang it. I guess I'll go to the shopping district. Maybe she's, uh... 
Maybe she's up there. I don't know. Anyway, she's a stupid bear, and I don't like her. I want her to leave. Like, she's just awful in every way. So, she needs to leave. Maybe she's shopping. Nope. There is a striped traffic cone. Hmm. Okay, so normally I would buy this fishing pole, but uh, Quindolin already gave us one, so we don't actually need that. So I think, I think we have like everything now. We also have this cute little gardening shop run by Leaf. He has kind of a weird face, but you know. So he sells stuff flowers and a tree and an axe and that's about it uh where are you Pauline? all right oh wait i think that's elvis's shirt the one that he's like currently wearing Yeah, Paula stole Elvis's shirt, and I'm really upset about it. Like, get your own freaking shirt. Oh, dude. What is this? Let's try it on. Oh my gosh. This, alright, this needs to happen. I have a problem. I buy too many accessories. I can't help it. Oh, I'm gonna buy that too. That would've been useful. A while ago. Um, seriously, these are your... Whatever. I don't want them. Alright, let's go. Alright. Paula! Ugh. Paula Abdul, where are you? Hello, chum! This is Kix. Uh, it's shoe store. And he sells shoes here, so... Wrestling shoes? I don't... I don't want these. Oh my gosh, I just thought of a great thing to give Lucy for her furniture. Oh. Ah. Uh, I have something perfect. We'll have to do that later, though. Um, let's, alright, let's go into Nook's Homes, because I need to pay off, I think I need to upgrade, actually. I don't know, I don't know, whatever. Welcome, welcome. Oh my goodness, it's Kida. So good to see you, hmm? Your home has now been built, yes, what do you think? Your house is now the stuff of dreams, hmm? And now the numbers. I deducted your down payment, leaving a grand total of 39,800 bills. That's the total amount of your paltry little loan. A mere trifle, really, yes? Oh, I have to pay the post office? Man. We do require that all homers become members of the Happy Home Academy, hmm? Is this a cult? Let us stop by from time to time and give your home an in-depth inspection. Very good to get one. Inspection is a comprehensive look at your room and furniture, layout, your hygiene level, etc. If you're given high marks, you might even receive a wonderfully elegant commemorative prize. They'll schedule the inspection, so there's nothing for you to worry about. No worries at all, hmm? What else? Members, you see, also gain access to the Happy Home Showcase behind the shopping district. Once you've received a letter that confirms your membership, you may visit the showcase at any time. Very good. Please do come see me if you wish to discuss further renovations, hmm? Sure. Whatever. I need to go pay that off, though. Because I think it unlocks the island. I think? Am I correct in that? I think... Oh, is this the mean one? No, this is the nice one. Okay. I think the mean one comes out at night. <laughs> oh no, it's the machine that I have to... Uh, repay loan, yes. Let me do that. Okay. Just take care of it all in one go.
Yay! Okay, well, I think that's gonna do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know how you like new Kitoria and the villagers and what you're thinking of the town and all that good stuff in the comments below. I'm really glad that a lot of you guys seem to like the last episode. I was not sure <laughs> if you guys would or not, but I'm glad that the majority of you seem to. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you're enjoying this series, be sure to give it a thumbs up because that really helps me out. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next episode.